minimum. Mayonnaise. I ain't got 750 to pay. Over my damn dead body you will not get me to ever see this again what about mr romantic comedy yeah, yeah see, you guys you guys hate romantic comedy me i love romantic comedies and i think this is a piece of <laughs> shit. this this is garbage this is it, it there's just nothing that works here i mean essentially what this is is somebody watched go, grew up watching ghost and said i wonder if we can make a romantic comedy about a ghost coming back trying to stop her her old fiance from falling in love yeah eva longoria plays a woman who tragically gets crushed by an ice statue on her wedding day her fiance played by paul rudd is supposedly depressed about her death and so his sister says i have somebody can help you so he goes to see this uh, this psychic they start to fall for each other and then all of a sudden eva longoria shows up as uh this ghost and starts tormenting this this psychic because she doesn't want them to hook up you know what jason biggs in real life might be the nicest guy in the world and matter of fact he probably has to be because he sucks on film i mean he just sucks the the life out of the room to me he's always playing I'm such a nice, goofy Jewish guy that I'm so nice that people take advantage of me. And doesn't that make me nice? No. It makes you a douchebag who deserves everything you get. And this role is no different. Damn, he's losing his right he's, now. He's, but th this film has no commitment. Like, yeah, like you said, Paul Rudd is supposed to be depressed about Eva Longoria dying, but he's cracking jokes left and right. I mean, if there's anything funny, it's just the fact that this guy has a morbid sense of humor. She's like, you're depressed? Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, my <laughs> wife died. <laughs> so what's this whole psychic thing about? <laughs> I hope you don't mind me asking, but how, um, how did it happen? She was crushed by an angel. And as sad as I am, I do appreciate the irony. Um, the, the psychic he's supposed to fall in love with, Lake Bell? Lake Bell, that's her name. Yeah, kind of cute and kind of mannish, too, in a way. These people are stupid. This woman, she can't simply, like, put mustard on a hot dog without getting it all over her dress. I mean, she's borderline retarded, almost. The sister's dumb, and Eva Longoria, you know, as sexy as she is, she's such a bitch, she, like... I don't even want to see her. Yeah, I don't give a damn if she's a ghost. I'll get my vacuum cleaner out and pull a Ghostbusters on a bitch ass. There was a moment where I said, well, you know, I mean, this, for those women who like goofy comedies like this, that's for them. But as that shit went along and these characters got dumber and this movie got dumber, I just said, nah, this is some old bullshit. No, no, this movie goes from bad to worse to just plain out of its damn monkey mind. This, this is some old bullshit. I mean, the thing about this movie is it's cheap. It's, it's quickly written, no special effects, uh, not even well acted, but there's no reason for it to be in a theater. It could just as well have been on TV or, you know, just something you rent. So I'm going to give it some old bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I was about to say, I'm really getting tired of seeing these movies where somebody's talking to the ghost. And, they, and you have to be stupid to know that nobody else can see this ghost. So you're going to like a crazy person talking to thin air. I mean, I, how many times have we seen this cliche in movies over and over again? I had to show a room full of guys my naked breasts because of you. That's a nice gesture, but unnecessary, dear. Well, it does show you one difference between men and women, because there's a scene where, where Lake Bell's gonna have sex with Paul Rudd with their clothes on. I don't know how they do that. Um, and Eva Longoria floats I... over her and distracts her from getting into it. Now, if you were a man, if a man is having sex, it could be his mama floating over him. He's like, hey, I'm still doing this. Yeah, I mean... Uh... Really? Because that would freak my shit out. Man, let me hey, tell you man. something. Zombies could be busted in the room. If I'm in something, I'm in something. I ain't going nowhere till I'm done. <laughs>